Okay, so let's do some more. This is a two-step problem, okay? So uh, it's not going to have power. It's not going to have time in it, right? Um, and we are raising a mass, so our force will be m times g, okay? Um, and let's just figure out what we've got here. Uh, oh, and then we're also going to use uh, work as force times distance. So let's see, 850 joules is our work, right? Because it's in joules, right? It says it's of work, so therefore it's work, right? Our distance is 8.7 meters. Okay. Um, and so uh, I think what we want to do, I think the first thing we're going to do is we've got everything. We've got uh, in the formula work is force times distance. We have everything but force. So let's do uh, work is force times distance. So 850 is force times 8.70. And now I can figure out the force, right? So 850 divided by 8.7 is 97.7 newtons, right? Force is 97.7, zero. There's a bunch of other stuff here, right, newtons. And now, now we're set. Now we can figure out the the force, the mass of it, right? Because we want to know what the mass is. So force is mg, right? So 97.70 is m times 9.8. And now we can just divide, right? So divide by 9.8, 9.969, yeah? So that'd be 9.97 kilograms, roughly, yeah? Alrighty. Good enough.